make you smile. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys? I hope you are all doing really well. I feel like it's been a while since I sat down and filmed a video. Um, yeah, I've just been writing, working on my new book, and also, you know, we've had a few, a couple of nice weather days, and I've been out and seen friends, went on a nice boat trip. As you saw, I did a short video of that. Um, so yeah, it's been nice to get out and about and enjoy the few days we've had. If you're a Brit, you understand, <laughs> but if not, we basically have one warm sunny day followed by a rainy windy day um but apparently we have got a heat wave coming so that will be interesting um but yeah so been writing been trying to make the most of summer when it appears but i thought i would it's about time <laughs> that i filmed a youtube video i feel like today's mostly going to be showing you some new things that i've bought recently and i'm going to go to home bargains i haven't been to home bargains in ages and i know you guys also enjoy a home bargains trip so i thought we could go together so at the beginning one of the new things i wanted to show you was a, a new mug i've got two new mugs from anthropology how cute is that as you guys know i do collect mugs a bit of a mug obsessive and i just i saw this on youtuber influencer georgia may's instagram um and i thought i need that I need that mug and it is half price at the moment in anthropology or on the website so you guys can get one as well and join me um so i think it's six pounds and yeah every morning a little bit of positivity to start the day is always a good thing so yeah very excited about that one but the best mug that i ordered at the same time as this one oh, because it represents our favorite time of year the best season, which isn't too far away, guys. I mean, let's not wish the summer away. But we know that we love autumn here. And I saw that Anthropology have some autumnal mugs. And I've only ever managed to buy one kind of autumn mug last year. Um, I think it says Hello Pumpkin from Next. Because, you know, in the UK, autumn things, we're starting to get more things. But sometimes they can be a bit tricky to find. So I saw this. I thought, well, there is no way I'm not buying this. It is a floral pumpkin mug. Can we just take a moment to appreciate how cute and autumnal this mug is? I am in love. I mean, if it's possible to be in love with a mug, then I'm in love with this mug. So as you can see, it's pumpkin shaped. It's got some lovely autumnal flowers. We've got an orange handle. How cute is that? This one was more expensive. This one was £14. And they've also got one that's like, a rusty colour with like pumpkins and squashes and, and things like that on it, which I kind of wanted to also get. I thought two mugs is okay. Three mugs is maybe going too far, but maybe we'll get it at some point. But I'm so excited to use this mug, but I'm going to wait. I'm going to save it until autumn, which is September the 1st, guys. In our world, it's September the 1st. We're going to decorate for autumn drink our autumn mugs and live our best autumn lives. So yeah, very excited by that. And actually I posted about it on Instagram and I had loads of people like get very excited and also buy it. So I love that we all like the cozy time of year here. Um, so yeah, very happy with my two new mugs and I had to show you guys. And I also made one more autumnal purchase actually which I'll show you later. I've left it upstairs. I'll get it later. A new blazer. So, you know, we're creeping in and I've heard rumours that the autumn decor is starting to filter in TK Maxx and HomeSense. So we definitely need to keep an eye on that. And I definitely want to go as soon as um, my TK Maxx has the autumn decor in because, yeah, we definitely need new decor for this year. And yeah, I was going to do a kind of summer haul in this video and I've ended up talking about autumn, but never mind. I will show you some summer things now. So as I said, I'm going to pop to Home Bargains. I'm just wearing a beigey linen shirt from H&M and I've got linen trousers on as well. And then I wanted to show you the accessories that I will be wearing because I picked up these new sandals from M&S this year and they're really comfortable, they're wide fit. As you guys know, I do find shoes a bit of a nightmare 
I have very weird shaped feet apparently. And so I was so excited to find these. I really like this um, gold color. And yeah, I've worn them once and they seemed pretty comfortable. So very pleased with those. And then I also picked up a new summer bag from River Island, which I love. It has this kind of straw raffia front and then at the back, it's kind of got a bit of a shimmer to it. I don't know if the iPhone is going to pick that up, but hopefully it is and gold handles and they just go really nicely together. So yeah, very happy with those summary purchases. And I think I have got a few more things to show you. I've kept a list. Um, so yeah, I'll show you more things when we get back from home bargains. And obviously I will show you anything that catches my eye in store and anything that I pick up. So yeah, um, see you guys in a bit. fairly new in or that wasn't there last time I went they had a lot of things for the garden lots of funny ornaments I had to show you guys and um, some new home decor and they also had some new candles in so I didn't go mad I picked up a couple of bits um some Sephora a couple of cleaning bits but I'm not going to bother showing you that it's pretty boring um but what I did pick up was I couldn't resist the candles section my current favorite candle is their carrot cake one and they had it in. So if you if you haven't um, smelt it, then definitely do because it's really nice. But I thought I'll get different ones this time. And um, I, I don't dare mention the word autumn again, do I? Because I feel like I've mentioned it a few times and I've still got to show you my slightly autumnal blazer that I picked up as well. But this did give me a little bit of autumn vibes. Um, this is their hot cross bun candle. I mean, first of all, the colour, very autumnal. And although I'm sure they brought this in for Easter, it smells that really like um, cinnamon, like um, spicy scent that you get with autumn candles. A bit of sweetness as well, which I love. And for $2.99, I think Home Bargains candles are the best because... They smell really strong, sometimes even too strong um, for the money. So yeah, I I thought 
I'm gonna pick this up and I'm gonna save it for the autumn cozy months. I'm a big candle fan, but I tend to burn my candles mostly in autumn and winter. I don't really have a summer fragrance, so I thought I would get a summer candle and I would burn it on summer evenings. And this one seemed to have a really strong, but also like a really fresh scent. So it's called Clean Linen and it does exactly what it says on the tin. It smells like freshly washed sheets that you've hung outside in the garden. Yeah, and I think it's just gonna be a really fresh, clean, kind of pleasant smell for the summer. They had a couple of fruity ones. I think I showed you in the video, but some of them weren't, weren't very strong. Some of them were too strong. Like the Cherry Bakewell one was like, wow. Like, I don't think I could like bear to burn it. Um, so this was kind of one of the summery ones that still had a strong fragrance to it. So yeah, those are the two candles I picked up and I'm very happy with my purchases. To be honest, I could have bought more, but I thought I'd just stick to two. And then I thought I would try this, mainly it's probably like a room spray. It's their pomegranate perfume. I think it's $3.99 and obviously it's trying to be a kind of Jo Malone dupe. Bottle's really nice and it's got that pomegranate, yeah, just fresh, fruity um, smell to it. So yeah, I think I'll probably use that as a room spray. But I guess on days where I don't wanna use my like proper perfume, I could also use this one. Um, but we'll see, we'll see how well the scent lasts because obviously it's $3.99, so I don't have big expectations. But then again, as we said, the candles are really good, so maybe this will be as well. I'll keep you posted. But yep, so I picked up that. And then the last thing to show you that's like a bit interesting and not just cleat the flora, um, I picked up these solar lights for the garden. I thought they were really pretty. They're kind of a rustic gold. And I've seen these... Um, that's where the, the solar catches the light and then it will light up. I've seen um, a few of these in garden centers and they were a lot more money than these. I think they were 3.99 and I think I hang them either side of the mirror in the garden. Um, so yeah, hopefully they work, but um, definitely a bargain compared to what I've seen down the garden centers. So yeah, fingers crossed they will look good in the garden. So yeah, that was everything I picked up in Home Bargains. As I mentioned at the start of the video, I have picked up one autumn piece already and it is this really lovely brown um, blazer from New Look. I love it, it's slightly oversized, got some slight shoulder pads in there and just one tortoiseshell button and I just love the rich chocolate brown colour of it. I think it's going to go with lots of things in my wardrobe. I think it was $39.99 and I do them in other colours as well. So yeah, I'm really excited about that and I think that's going to be a really lovely piece for autumn. I'm going to mention the word again and then we're going to leave it. I'll show you the other summary bits I didn't show you at the start of the video. I picked up this skirt. So you might not remember, but I bought a black pleated skirt and I wasn't sure whether to keep it because it wasn't something that I really wore. And I've actually really loved wearing it and I've worn it more than I thought I would. And I saw that H&M had some pleated skirts on their website. So I ordered this um, cream one. I think it was $24.99 and I picked it up in a medium and I just think it's so lovely and yeah, it's um, a really pretty summer piece in my wardrobe. I kind of made it casual with a linen shirt and trainers. I'll pop the picture here. Um, but I think I can also dress it up with a blouse and my gold sandals. Um, you can wear it with ballet flats, heels. I think it's really versatile. So I'm really pleased that I picked that up. And so now I've got two pleated skirts in my wardrobe and yeah, I think i um, really loving them. So I'm really pleased that I got that. And then, so not only did I find a pair of gold sandals in m and I also found a pair of ballet pumps. So I've done really well with shoes lately because as I said, usually it's just really difficult for me. So these are again part of their wide fit range and they are these really cute ballet pumps. I mean, how adorable are these? 
They are like a light leopard print with a bow and they're kind of like, you won't probably be able to see on the camera, like a slight furry kind of feel to them. And I just think, again, they're really versatile. They'll go with trousers, skirts, dresses. I feel like it goes nicely with my cream skirt and my black one. And I can't remember how much they are. Oh, it says on the back still, I haven't taken the labels off because I haven't worn them, 35 pounds. And they're just really nice. I don't know how, comfortable they are because like I said I haven't worn them yet because we are in summer and I'm trying to wear sandals even if the British weather doesn't always play ball on that um but yeah I think for autumn I've said the word again um they'll be really great so yeah really pleased with those and then just one other thing I'm really sorry if you've seen all these if you follow me on Instagram if not definitely follow me on Instagram but we like a haul on here so i thought i'd just show you because yeah as i said i haven't like done a video for a while so i thought i'd just up to date you guys with what i picked up for summer so i also got myself another bag did i need another bag probably not but this was in my defense half price in accessorized it was like 15 pounds and i'd seen it in there full price and hadn't bought it so when it was in the sale i just thought it's a sign it's meant to be and it's just a really again versatile piece because it's just a plain tan colored bag it goes with everything i've got some tan sandals that it goes really nicely with and i really like the bamboo handles on there as well so i just thought that's a really sweet bag and i really like top handle bags they're kind of the main style of bag that i buy at the moment so as I said, it was just meant to be and I could not take it home with me. <laughs> and then to finish the haul, I picked up a couple more books. So my last video was about what I will be reading this summer and I've read a few of those books already and I met up with an author friend and we ended up in a bookshop, which is a very dangerous place for authors to end up in and I brought three more books to add to my summer romance reading list. I've just started this one this morning actually. It's called It Happened One Summer. Looks really cute. I've heard good things about Tessa Bailey's books so I'm excited to read this one. And then The Kiss Quotient. Am I saying that right? I think so. I hope so. That kind of gave me soulmate equation kind of vibes. So I'm interested to read that one. And then as you know I've read a couple Christina Lauren books so I saw this one which I haven't read and thought I would pick it up Josh and Hazel's guide to not dating so yeah three more to add to the summer reading list and yeah looking forward to reading them in hopefully the heat wave next week but we shall see because as I said before it's a British summer we never know <laughs> I think that's everything that I wanted to show you guys today. I wasn't sure about this video because I felt like it didn't have a strong theme, but often I just watch people's day-to-day -day vlogs and I enjoy them. So let me know if you really like a strong theme, set theme to a video, or if you're happy to just see whatever. Um, but yeah, it was nice to get out to home bargains and show you everything that I picked up, show you everything new in. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Let me know if you picked up anything um, that you're excited about recently. And let me know if you maybe are looking forward to the cozy autumn months of the things that we can buy for it because I'm starting to, now that I found a couple of things, I'm starting to think, ooh, can't wait for <laughs> the next season. Anyway, let's not wish the summer away. Come on, we've got a heat wave coming up. Let's enjoy it and we'll just keep our eyes Let's keep our eyes peeled for autumn things but yeah really hope you enjoyed this video hope you guys are okay um please do give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already i am now gonna go and make some dinner i think so yeah um let me know how you guys are in the comments and hopefully i'll see you very soon for a new video thanks for watching guys take care look after yourself Bye.